What's up guys? We're back. Today we are going to Osaka. We've been stuck at our home for two days because it's raining and today it's still it's still raining but uh, we really have to go out because uh, number one I'm gonna get in some money. Story is I sent some money and uh, that money was being sent back so I have to claim it before it expires of course. So that's our first mission and the second mission was is to buy a new curling iron. Yeah. For Kenze, because uh, in the previous vlog she broke her curling iron, we weren't able to film it, but uh, she broke it. So we are going, by the way, to the biggest appliance store or shopping mall in the whole of Osaka. And if you do not know yet, Osaka is like one of the rivaling cities to Tokyo. So expect that it would be big. And our third mission, also in reference to the previous vlog, is on that same building, there's there's a whole floor for hobbies. So I'll, I'll also try to look for some basketball NBA cards. That's it. That's our mission. And uh, let's see. Let's see what happens. See you later. So we have just arrived in Osaka and that's the appliance store that we are going to afterwards. But for now, we have to hurry up and go to uh, Western Union to claim our money first. So let's go. Oh. It's like, it, <laughs> it almost opened, but uh, it seems like... Oh! <laughs> we got pranked! Apparently, uh, we'll have to go through another entrance. <laughs> we got pranked! <laughs> So that's like one of the main parts. Okay, here's the open one. San Union Tema I Taimas. Another entrance. Oh it's probably here. I don't know. Okay. Oh, this is it guys. Let's go. If you're a tourist or a resident here in Japan and then you need to send or receive money uh, travel X usually has a Western Union on it uh, in most major Japan railway stations so you just have to bring your passport or ID or if you're a resident just bring your my number card so uh, apparently we couldn't claim the money <laughs> because the sender put my first name on the family name because of that mismatch they can't let me claim the money so so our first mission is a failed mission today I'll just contact my sender to do necessary adjustments to the form but uh, yeah when you send or receive money here in Japan uh, make sure to fill out the forms accordingly if it's the if they say first name put the first name on it if it's the family name put family name uh, just fill up the form accordingly so we are proceeding to our next mission so that is the building that we are talking about it's big right it's big if this is the universal symbol of small then it doesn't fit it doesn't fit, so it's big, guys, so... <laughs> it doesn't fit! Let's go! <laughs> oh, more bad news. It's still gonna rain tomorrow. Looks like it's up to the 13th floor. I think we're on the right floor. Oh, it's all iPhones here, you guys. <laughs> still on the same floor. Oh, is that what you want? It's like, what, $500, $600? Look at this one. Oh, look at her eyes. Oh. <laughs> Let me show you how huge she's saying it. Look at that. There's even a men's section. I wonder what that what that what that does. I wonder what that does. I found it. What does it do? Metal lift neck. Oh, it says that aging can also be seen on the neck. So in order to prevent that aging of the neck, you would want to use that product. Ooh, that's new. What's that? This one seems good. It's not not too expensive either. Oh, it's just straightening oh so there's for straightening just for curling and now she found something that's for straightening and for curling this place got everything <laughs> 5k lang. so it's just like 50 dollars for a straightener and the curler 
and the brand is already uh, Panasonic Beauty. So, May diamond. Po. Diamond? <laughs> Can you show the diamonds to the camera? Oh, a lona. Oh, that looks slick. Oh, even cheaper than the previous one. And you'd, you'd know from the name that it's salon quality. So, uh, so the difference is the weight. This one is very, very light. Candidate number one. Multi iron with diamonds and everything. Candidate number two. Panasonic car iron. I can say is choosing from a myriad of options. Uh, let's let's see what's what's at the back of the beauty product. Face. Oh, some VR stuff. Oh, so they have something for Android, huh? Toothbrush Haven. They've got a toothbrush haven. Some body care. Massage stuff. Ooh. Oh. What are these? Weighing scales. Again, some body body care stuff. Is this like the biggest Uniqlo store you'll ever find? Let's see. Alcohol first. Check your temperature. Ooh. Ooh. This is a huge Uniqlo store. And mind you, we are in, on the same building. Yodobashi camera. It's just on the, on the length side, but it shows you how huge this building is. Ooh. Candidate number three, Tuscan two-way iron. <laughs> this one has that like uh, sassy feel to it because of the design. Candidate number four, Paul and Joe. So Fiance will be using this for like the next three or four years. So she's carefully picking her options. And I think we found our candidate number five. Koizumi? Koizumi. It's slick. It's like, it's clean. The design is clean. And the price is clean. <laughs> so as Fiance is exploring, uh, I just like to ask for your support for this channel, guys. If, if you're in Japan and you're shopping on Amazon, I'll be leaving the links down below of, of these items. Even for other items, if, if you're gonna shop in Amazon, by the way, this is the links so uh, this channel might have a small commission without no additional fees to you guys. Just use the link and the Amazon will, will trace it back to this channel. Also, please don't forget to subscribe. So thank you. Thank you so much for your support. Back to the vlog. Oh, this one looks like a rose. That's like a rose. Oh. Okay, so that's the concept. Confirmed. It's like, it's like a rose. Is this like the weird the weird shaped section? Oh, so you just place your hair there? That one looks better, the pink one. Tamad section, ladies and gentlemen. This looks weird too. So Fiance is looking for a straight and curl combination with 100 to 240 volts so that it could be used like worldwide. So, so that you could use it in the Philippines. Look at her. She's confused. Also, this is the best one. 200 volts. Worldwide voltage. Hi, guys. Oh. Welcome to Ladies and gentlemen, the winner is candidate number four. Brand is Tescom. I'm gonna look for that on Amazon and just link it below. So you just get like a barcode and just bring it to the counter. You don't have to bring the item yourself. Okay, mission accomplished. Yeah. Let's go to our next stop. So they've got like the hobbies, amusement on the fifth floor, and they've also got sports on the sixth floor. So these are the floors that we are going to explore from now on. Let's go. So we have just arrived in the games and hobbies spot, which is the fifth floor. Look how huge this thing is. <laughs> Huge, huge floor. Ooh, I'm looking for a smaller classic version of this one for a friend. So let's see if, if we could let's see if we could find that as well in here. 
And yes, we are still in the same building as the building that we just bought the curling and uh, straightening iron. So <laughs> for now, I'm gonna go to the CR because I, I, I couldn't hold it. See you later. Look at this, guys. So that's the restroom. Just in front of that sign. Oh, oh, it's a Tamiya track with, with all, all of the goodies behind it. Wow. Social distancing. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's a real person. It's a real person. I thought it was something else. Yeah. And it's a whole new world on the other side. Wow, this is Lego. Wow! Look at this! Hey man, can I touch your sword? Osaka Castle, and then there's, wow. Look at these two. Oh, wow. Still no cards for me, but camping. Check this out. There's this air going out of the shirt. And the secret to that is, is the fan behind it. So you'd see this often in like uh, outdoor workers here in Japan. They've just got <laughs> such an awesome, <laughs> awesome shirt. Look at this. I still can't find any cards. We found some Tamiya. We found some life-size Star Wars figures. But I'm I'm still wondering where the where the heck the cards are. <laughs> Perhaps uh, there, there's none in here. So I'll just, I'll just go back to Mint and just and just really buy something so I could just start it. So I could just start the hobby. Give me some luck, guys. Leave me a like, a comment, something. Uh, just 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 send me some luck, please. <laughs> because so far I'm, I'm I'm not I'm not feeling the luck. What do you do with these? Also, oh, you make them, you turn them into like anime characters. Sounds cool. Wow. Mm, no. Zeta? Still no luck. Even with the Gundam. Ray, if you're watching, you might have to wait a little bit more. I'll find you your Zeta, I promise. <laughs> but not today, huh? Not today. My whole PlayStation and Nintendo section. So, what? There's a PS5 here? Oh, yeah. Really? She says she would want to buy a Mario and a Luigi. If you do not know yet, she's, she's a bit of a logo, a Lego fan. Not included. Not included, I told you. So you apparently have to buy the whole starter course to avail of the figures and so she just wants Mario and Luigi but not the rest so no there's nothing you'd have to buy this to avail Mario and Luigi marketing it's called marketing there's reactions like the <laughs> <laughs> so the set is, is just too expensive for her right now. She can't afford it, but, but she just wants the figure. So. We meet again. Can I touch your sword? Can I touch your sword? <laughs> what? 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 It's like seven eighty dollars. What?
so it's made to order but there's a Nezuko figure out here some Gundam as well Mask Rider I think found it <laughs> it's a lock it's a lock I'm sure she'll buy it <laughs> wow Nezuko they've also got all the other characters <laughs> look at him <laughs> oh hey all right I didn't notice that it was it was Naruto. She didn't buy it. <laughs> Too expensive. Next time. <laughs> so that's how big this place is. We went from just buying an iron and a card to thinking of buying like action figures. It's it's cool though. It's entertaining. It's refreshing. We we are here right away. It's odd. I usually go to these stores for some shoes. And this time I'll be looking for some cards. We are still in the same building, by the way. <laughs> We're just up one floor. This is the sixth floor. They call it the fashion and sports floor. And we'll be looking at some shoes. But we will actually be looking for some carts. We've got the Space Jump tees. Oh, cute. In here. It's cute. Space Jam, it's all Space Jam. So this guy's the guy out here. You know that he's the guy out here because, yeah, <laughs> he's the guy. <laughs> He's the guy out here. Good job. I'm actually thinking of buying one. Okay. Oh, she's strong. So at home, I'm, I'm just using an iron pitcher with some water. Okay, one cup. One cup per kilo. Huh? No. So this is just two. Two kilograms. No, this this is not how I feel while lifting the pitcher. It's like perhaps four kilograms. Four kilos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm good at four kilos. I'm so weak. <laughs> I'll be strong very soon, but so we didn't find what we're looking for once again. It's going as planned so far. We were just thinking of buying a couple of things and then the rest would just be like a window shopping for you guys. So I think we've achieved our goal. I just couldn't find any cards. There are like a hundred restaurants in the top floor, in one of the top floors, but uh, we've got plenty of food at home. So we are hungry, but uh, we'll, we'll be going home to eat. We won't be eating here. So our last stop would be Mint from our previous vlog. I think I'm, I'm gonna buy uh, like three packs of cards, then Let's do our first break. Ooh. So she'll also be uh, trying her newly bought appliance yeah. when we get home for sure. So please stay tuned. I'll be showing you the cards and a review of the product she just bought. So we will exit from the camera land floor. A floor which is just full of cameras. Oh, oh. Oh, tapos. Mm. <laughs> yeah, as I've said, it's it's the camera world right now. What do you think guys? Shall I quit phone vlogging and switch to this one? It's quite expensive though. It's too expensive. I've got a beautiful, well-functioning phone. You know this is the area for lenses, right? 
Oh, it is. What a surprise. It's the area for lenses. What a surprise. <laughs> One million yen. <laughs> I felt like I found a, something like a big fish on a river <laughs> when, I, when I saw that one. That's it. We are nearing the exit of this humongous place and uh, we'll proceed to buying some cards at Mint just near the station that we'll be riding and, and uh, it seems terrible outside it seems uh, it's darker so as we were crossing that bridge we just changed our mind so this added content for you guys we will be eating at Ichiran because we, we, we can't help it we, we're too hungry to go home and eat so we'll be eating at Ichiran we'll be eating some ramen later What's up guys? We are here once again in Mint and uh, I think I'm gonna buy something this time just even just the four pack one so, so I can't afford any of those boxes so I'm just gonna settle for these panini hoops NBA hoops they cost 4,400 yen these are sticker cards Okay. 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 So we got it. It's not too much. I don't know. I, did, I didn't think too much. I just wanted to buy and start this one. So I'm excited to open this up for you guys to break it up. But uh, first, we we just ha we have to eat. <laughs> we have to eat, right? So <laughs> let's eat. <laughs> so this one's quite new. They've added some electronic options in ordering in contrast to the cash only vendo so we we are definitely trying this one out ito lang ako 980 it's okay you like to half oh. i always go for a half half extra noodles yeah okay okay so our debit card is an ID card. Is that my number? Oh. oh, amazing! You circle your preference. I'll go for yeah, medium, medium richness, medium garlic, of course, some green onion with chasher, of course. Then I'll go with. Spicy times two. Firm? Okay. Then just medium. Okay. So we have just filled up the checklist of our preferences and how the ramen is to be made. If you like spicy food, I recommend times two. Right? Hmm? Times two spice. No, mine is medium. Times one is not, it's not really, it's not that hot. Hot. It's not that hot. So that indicates the vacant seats. You can open this one, by the way, through the company. Then they'll get your order by the window. So this plate is very, very important. It's for your extra noodles. So if you need them, you just place them here. If you don't place this here, you won't be able to... You won't be able to avail your extra noodles. So please make sure you place it here just when you need it. You've got your own water. You've got your own faucet. It's weird, but yes, you've got your own faucet of water in front of you. And because it's COVID, they've also got some sanitizer for you. A ball pen for if, if you want to add more extra order. You've got, you've got your own set of chopsticks. You've got your water cup here. So. Yeah. The key to really enjoying this is that focus on taste <laughs> okay, shimas. so they place your order from the magic window this guys so I almost have the noodles 
and uh, it takes a bit of time for the extra noodles to arrive so what I do is I place it in the bounce watch what happens so I'll just wait for a while and uh, the extra noodles will soon arrive so as you can see just as um, I'm running out of noodles it's here it's impeccable timing through <laughs> what three years of experience <laughs> eating here this is really our go-to place when it comes to ramen by the way you need some no oh so we've got this all for ourselves Make sure you mix it well so it soaks. It's like we're starting all over again. <laughs> so one last pro tip. Try doing it uh, bottoms down and see what happens. There's something written. What does it say? Yorokobides. Oh. You're so happy. Yeah, it's it's like yeah. You're happy. You appreciate it. Yeah, it's like it's like a thank you. Alright, that's it. It seems that we had a good... She had a good buy. Yeah. I can reduce the temperature, so... Oh, you could reduce the temperature. There's a steamer. Yeah. It's for straight curl and... You could use it anywhere in the world because yeah. it's 100 to 240 watts. So it's Tesco. So that's it. I think <laughs> she got addicted <laughs> and we'll do the full hair, but for now that's all that we could show you. So as I've said earlier, I'm, I'm going to link it down below and you could use the link for shopping. If you shop on Amazon anyway, please support this channel by using that link to go to Amazon. Okay, so that's it for Fiancé's review of her product and now it's time for this one. Alright, so our setup is ready and this is it guys. Uh, we are opening these three packs of NBA hoop cards from Panini and let's see if, if you'll get what's promised here there's nothing re really <laughs> except they're they're like promising a lamello ball card so let's see just a little background of why I'm doing this just the previous video I had a collab with log B breaks my friend Norvin in their house in Nagoya and he gave me my first ever card which is Derek Rose from New York where uh, he's like comeback stories written at the back so before he actually gave me this one I was kind of hooked with the idea of collecting some cards so I bought this one just for me to try out and, uh, and see, see where it goes from here so without further ado, let's just unpack this one. It's got three packs and a... Ooh, I wonder what it is. What? What? I thought this would be like a plastic container. But there's like a signed DeAndre Liggins. It's, and they say it's totally certified. You've also got Mitch Richmond. It's a memorabilia, so I guess this player is quite... He's retired. 
Oh, I think I saw this this player during uh, some early, what do you call this? Some early like NBA arcade games when I was like 14 years old, I guess. So this this guy was definitely a Kings player, I think. So wow, some retro stuff and DeAndre Liggins. Ooh, surprise! Right away, there's a surprise, and they're they're also quite well wrapped up. So we'll add that immediately. All right, so pretty good start to this break, and uh, let's see let's see what else we've got in store for us. So these are the three cards. It's 2020 to 2021. Okay, so let's start with our, our first patch. I wish I had Panning Norgan with me here or somebody else but uh just let me do this for now I'll, I'll do this on my own whoa first one is lamarcus aldridge then you've got blake griffin what these are pretty pretty solid actually forgive me because i i, I can't really judge if, if a card is like worth something but i surely recognize these few players we have you even got Shakam right away, Malik Beasley, and Matisse Thibel. Well, this is the first one that I, I don't I don't really recognize that much. His name is Jalen Smith, but it's a rookie card. And we've got one more, but it's from the Wizards, so it's not Lamelo. Danny Abdiya. All right. Next, I've mentioned in the earlier vlog to Norvin that I, I would really be happy to see a Peja Stojakovic card regardless of the value of the card I just I just really he was my favorite player so I would be glad to see a Peja Stojakovic card probably not here because it's 2020 2021 but soon I want to have that soon Clint Capella you've got Buddy Heald these are pretty solid players but Daniel Thais We've got Reggie Jackson, Dante DiVincenzo, and ooh, what's this? This this is like the first one that that looks quite different. It's a rookie card, Emmanuel. Quickly, we got next. Okay. Speed shooting. Okay, he's got speed and shooting. All right, we'll probably have to wrap this one because it looks special. But to be honest, wow, you've got Alexej Pukusevsky. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce him, but I think he will. He, this guy's pretty good. He's pretty good, I think. Then you've got an Isaac Okoro. If you remember in the previous vlog, you've got an Astate of this player, which is which I think has a bright future. And that's it. <laughs> we are down to our last pack. Let's see if, if we get some Lamello ball. Okay, who's the first one? All right, Jimmy Neutron, Duncan Robinson. Next one is also a good player, Paul Millsap. Next one is also a champ, Tristan Thompson. Is this still in Cleveland? Next up is Otto Port, Otto Porter. And then Eric Pascal of the Warriors. <laughs> what? Wow! We've got a numbered card, which is Ray Allen from the Shadow Su Supersonics. This was like his original team. Oh no, he was from Milwaukee and then to Shadow before he went to Boston, I think. Five forty-five out of. Uh, 699. Wow, we have we just had our first numbered card. And it's Ray Allen. And it's Ray Allen. Alright. Wow, I didn't expect that. Then we've got Stuart and Noora, which I I'm sorry, but I don't I don't really recognize. So we didn't get Lamello, but to accompany Dark Rose out here. We've got Emmanuel quickly. Uh, we got next, rookie card. 
We've also got yeah, uh, DeAndre Liggins, totally certified rookie card, which is also autographed. I wonder how this costs. We'll find out later. Then we've got Mitch Richmond, which I'm sure is like a, a starting five caliber player. Oh, he's an all-star caliber talent, and it's also numbered 394 499. Wow! You've got a number card of Mitch Richmond and Ray Allen. And it's a pity I don't have anything to wrap them. So that's it. You've got you've got a Ray Allen card, guys. 545 of 699. So this is the luck that I've been looking for. So thank you. Thank you, Log B Breaks, for introducing me to this uh, hobby. And uh, let's see if, if we could follow up with uh, a real box break next time. But for now, that's it, you guys. Thank you. Thank you for watching. So that's it for today's vlog. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, for more of Japan, for more of uh, fu the fun stuff. Uh, Please subscribe, please leave a like, it really helps me with the algorithm. And uh, I hope to give you more meaningful and fun content soon. So please stay tuned on this vlog. Have a healthy, happy, abundant life, everyone. God bless you all. Bye-bye. Next time.